नमस्कार वेलकम टू दिस एडिशन ऑफ न्यूज बुलेटिन इन द हेडलाइंस टुडे क्रिएटिव एंडीवर्स ऑफ हॉट स्ट्रिप मिल एम्प्लॉयज ब्रिंग अबाउट अ सब्सटेंशियल सेविंग्स फॉर द कंपनी Fire and gas safety workshop organized for housewives of Steel Township. And annual science, arts and crafts exhibition held at Ispat Vidya Mandir of Raukela Steel Plant. Now the news in details. The innovative ideas and creative endeavors of employees of Hot Strip Mill Rorkila Steel Plant have helped in bringing about substantial recurring savings of more than a crore for the company. It may be noted that there are two walking beam reheating furnaces in the Hot Strip Mill in which slabs are charged for proper heating, soaking as well as smooth rolling. Scales are being formed on the slabs inside the reheating furnace due to excessive heat and falling of water in the trough. Scale accumulation in water trough needs to be removed to eliminate furnace breakdown. Earlier, scales used to be removed manually to a distance of 40 meters. This entire process used to cause delay and loss of production. To eliminate this problem, a team comprising Mr. B. R. Kumar, DGM, Mr. N. Mohalik, Senior Manager, Mr. C. Das, Assistant Manager, Mr. O. K. Naik, Mr. R. C. Mohanta, Mr. P. K. Patra, Mr. A. K. Biswal, Mr. M. Ikka, Mr. K. Gop, Mr. R. Mudali, Mr. D. Pasayat, all Assistant Rollers, Mr. B. Murmu, Mr. A. Kispotta, Mr. C. Jena, all Senior Technicians, Mr. B. Jena and Mr. A. Deep, both operators of the department undertook the task of solving the problem. The group decided to drastically reduce the distance of flushing point from existing 40 meter to a manageable distance. Using the available in-house resources, the group arranged for a pipe of 150 mm diameter and 3 meter length with a wall. This was fixed near the water trough, reducing the distance of movement of scale to 10 meters. This has ensured easier and timely opening of the wall twice during every shift to eliminate the accumulation of scales in the soaking zone. Implementation of this facility has totally eliminated the accumulation of scales in water trough at soaking zone. This has also increased the efficiency of furnace resulting in better quality rolling and improved productivity. It has also arrested water leakage and ensured safe working environment. All this have brought a substantial recurring saving of Rs 1.35 crore for the company. A fire and gas safety awareness program was conducted for housewives of Steel Township by Fire Services Department in collaboration with Indian Gas at Sector 17 Community Centre on 9th December. Mr. J. B. Patnaik, AGM Fire Services RSP and Mr. Prasanna Tripathi, Senior Journalist were present on the occasion. In all, 50 housewives participated in the program. During the workshop, different aspects of fire prevention and control and safety were discussed threadbare. A session on home fire safety was conducted with hands-on demonstration of a portable fire extinguisher. Safe usage of LPG cylinders was also discussed. First aid firefighting techniques were also demonstrated along with theoretical inputs on basic chemistry of fire. The sessions were conducted by the team from Fire Services Department of RSP. The program was coordinated by Mr. M. I. Sonkusari, Manager Fire Services. The annual Science, Arts and Crafts exhibition of Ispat Vidya Mandir Sector 19 was held in the institution campus on 8th December. Mr. P. C. Das, DGM in charge and HOD TS graced the occasion as the chief guest while Mr. B. K. Raut, AGM TS Education was the guest of honor. Dr. Atanu Kumar Tripathi, former principal government degree college Kutra was the chief speaker of the function. The students of the institution displayed around 
40 science and arts exhibits which were highly appreciated by the guests. The exhibits were judged by Dr. Sanatan Pradhan, Reader in Botany, H.K. Rai Mahavidyalaya and Dr. Chintamani Sahu, Reader in Chemistry, Vedivas Mahavidyalaya. The guests presented prizes to the winners. Ms. Pushpa Khanum, Headmistress and Manager Education presided over the function and welcomed the guests. Ms. Arati Singh, Department of Physics coordinated the meeting and Mrs. Seema Mohanta, Department of Botany proposed a formal vote of thanks. And with this, we have come to the end of this edition of News Bulletin. Namaskar.